Hey boys, welcome back to some more Broncos 2022 career mode. And uh, yeah, we're, we're killing it. We're killing it so far in the season, taking on the Roosters in round six. So this is probably... I, I mean, it's 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 one of the toughest clashes we're gonna we're gonna face all year. Uh, full full strength outfit on the on the park here. Kiri's back, Manu back, uh, forward pack there. Sam Barrels, great back row. Connor Watson, Connor Watson, the new recruit. Which I, I mean, I'm oh man, it's it's a good signing for the Roosters. Don't get me wrong. And I mean, I guess he, he started his career at the at the Roosters, so you can't be you can't be too annoyed that they they poached him or anything. But um, yeah, I'm I'm sad to see Watson leave the Knights. Um, because you know I, I like I like the Knights. I don't particularly like the Roosters, but. <laughs> But you know, I, I like Connor Watson as a player, so it's good to see him. Like last year, pretty much played the full full season. He might have missed a couple of games, but uh, you know that's one thing he's he struggled with his whole career is just uh, putting together a full season without injury. So it was, it was great to see, and hopefully you can continue that. As Katoni down the sideline, palms off Tedesco, gets the offload back to Herbie, but uh, that man Tedesco made a made up good ground to to get up and, and do the second effort there but a good start early good start early um and i mean the roosters i mean it's it is a great team on paper but uh they're not they're not unbeatable and the the funny thing is uh it's beautiful play here jordan ricky through oh, he gets the offload but man that man again james tedesco just uh everywhere the everywhere man just across takes the takes the pick off there and uh unfortunate because we were looking we were looking very slick but uh i was gonna say the broncos actually have like for how bad the broncos have been in the last couple of years and how good the roosters have been in the last couple of years the broncos i don't know it off the top of my head but uh i, I feel like the broncos have a decent like win win record over the roosters in the last couple of years like it, it's just i don't know there, there's been some classic matches between these two clubs even with the broncos I, I don't know. They they seem to they seem to play their better footy against them for some reason. Um, it'd be nice to see that <laughs> that performance against every club is right here. That was a nice play. It was uh, it was good uh, good hands across there. Tedesco through the last pass to to Manu who could have got it off to to Daniel Tupo, but uh, Manu that close to try line, not going to be stopped. And I'm uh, I'm dis well actually. What what did Manu did Manu end up signing with the with the Roosters re-signing? Um, I don't know if that's finalized yet. Is it? Because I don't think it... Well, his contract's up, I think. It was up in 2023. And, uh... Oh, that's... Look at that. That was a beautiful ball to Cobo, dude. That was... That was... Go back and watch that again. That was silky from, uh... Adam Reynolds as, uh... We look to go for our tried and true play here. It didn't quite work out in the pass. Oh, it goes forward. Maybe it was, but uh, the, the pass was on, just uh, not executed. Is right here. Corey O's, he can't get it. Daniel Tupo, and then Tessie New comes across. Probably a try saver, but he does give away the high tackle penalty. So, disappointing right there. Um, but I can't remember, did, did Manu eventually re-sign with the Roosters beyond? I can't... Dude, there's been so many, there's been so many talk about with signings and, and everything with obviously Redcliffe coming in and, uh, and just plays off contract as crying there goes straight through some, uh, some flimsy defense on our part. Um, but so much, so much talk, so many rumors. I, I can't even remember what happened with Manu if he's made his decision yet, but I like a lot of clubs. I'm like, I mean, I think the Titans were obviously the Titans have sort of, as they, they do score a try right here. You know, just giving them, giving them possession that close to try line. It's always going to be fought with danger. Um, but I was, I was very hopeful that the Titans would get him. And, uh, I mean, all the, all the, I mean, yeah, uh, any club picking up Joey Manu is, uh, I think I, from memory, he did resign with the, with the Roosters on like less money, which has got, <laughs> which annoyed everyone, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. Um, but yeah, he, he was a guy that you could, you could build a club around. And I was, I was like, yeah, the, the Dolphins, dude, they should, they should try going big after him and honestly playing with fullback. I actually, I think Manu, I think Manu, like he's not going to play fullback with Tedesco there, but, uh, he will, he might never really because of other fullbacks ahead of him, but honestly, he would make a fantastic fullback. I think he is one guy, like there's a lot of outside backs that they, you know, you talk up and 
they look like they could play fullback, but I think he is one guy that has the has the skill uh, and not just the you know the one on one brilliance so to speak. But uh, we'll go back to the game here. There's still, I mean, there's still time to go as uh, Keenan Palacia goes straight through there. Some uh, some uh, some big charges there. So. We're, we're looking, I mean, we're looking okay. The Roosters have, have turned up, and uh, they've, they've made us pay on a couple of uh, our indiscretions. We, uh, we just haven't quite been able to, you know, win the, win the field uh, territory at the moment as Reynolds tastes the line, cops the big shot, and uh, I mean, I guess that's been the, that's been the, the story of the, of the game so far just the the defense on the roosters just been a little bit better than us um and we prided ourselves on our defensive effort in the in the opening five rounds we just haven't uh haven't quite been able to 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 continue that uh that dominance but we still again still plenty of time 15 minutes we got some we got some x-factor players out here Payne Haas back on the field for his stint beautiful pull around the corner Corey Jensen onto Jordan Ricky Jordan Ricky oh he had so many options oh he could have he could have gone himself he had two players outside of him and Daniel Tupo just sticks the big left mid out and takes it oh it, it would have been what a what a try the pass from Payne Haas beat one. The little pass around the corner to Corey Jensen. That was that was beautiful play as uh, Albert Kelly here off the scrum gets it onto Herbie. Herbie down the sideline. He's in touch. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, the Roosters. Who came up with that try saver? I don't know how he didn't score. It was a nice play off the scrum. We gave ourselves another sniff. I think it's Sawali there coming across. Jeez, it was close. We got to look at this on replay because I, I thought I thought he got there. We dove a little bit early. Um, is the hand... The hand may go out here. I think that's what happens. Yeah, the hand. Ah, oh, the hand touches just before the chalk. Oh, if he just could have kept it off the ground just for a, for a f fraction longer... Would have been a try, but uh, not to be. This is honestly for for a ten nil score. This has been one of the most exciting games of the career so far. It's it's been an absolute classic. And still, there's there's just under ten minutes. We've got time. Albert Kelly here off the scrum gets it onto Katoni Stags. Katoni beats him. Gets it onto Herbie. Herbie beats one. He passes it. Comes off the rooster player. Oh man, we finally score. And it was. Uh, off the scrum play there it was it was good work herbie i i, I passed it obviously i didn't realize he was going to beat the tackle like that and we got a little bit fortuitous with the with the little rebound but uh i think that's a it's a pretty well deserved try we we've been <laughs> we've been close we've been mighty close many times but uh the roosters have have thwarted us but uh unfortunately we were coming hard but uh we we've, we've come up with a big mistake here given the Roosters final potentially the final crack of this game and that, that's exactly what's going to happen so Ali here 101 beats his opposing sentiment uh, I think it's Katoni Katoni and uh, Sawali a couple of the couple of the young guns um, and that's that's going to put a knife in the hearts of our our comeback we we, we, we definitely had the ascendancy we, we were controlling the the territory we were we were fighting hard um but the roosters we just gave them a little sniff there and they they took full advantage to uh to snuff us out so the roosters are gonna gonna put an end to our winning streak it's, it's been a good one five five on the trot to start the year usually i start the year pretty badly with uh, with a new club i just i can't get into the rhythm um but uh we started well this one honestly it was a good game like we came up with a lot of errors but it was a solid game of footy hopefully you guys are enjoying the series make sure to like and comment and i'll see you in the next one